Care for a drink while you wait, man. What are you doing? Stop coming over here. He's on his way. Well, hello, Victor. Hello, dear. So, I guess we should order, I suppose. Actually, there's, there's no need. Good evening, sir. Good evening. The lady and I will have the most expensive course on the menu, along with your finest dessert. I want to ensure tonight ends on a sweet note. Isn't she just drop dead gorgeous? Of course, sir. I'll be back with the appetizers shortly. Oh, you didn't have to do that. But I want this to be a night you never forget. Well, tell me about your day. Oh, um, well, Actually, here, let me, let me start. Today I woke up and uh, I made some breakfast, right? And so I'm going to work and while I'm at work, I talked to Carl for a little bit. You remember Carl, right? Yeah, so Carl was telling me about the recent events of his divorce. It's pretty tragic what happened between him and his wife, isn't it? The man was devastated. He's barely gotten any sleep recently. He's fallen behind at work and he had to move all of his stuff out of his crappy apartment he doesn't even like. He's just really going through it. All of this because of his ungrateful, despicable wife cheated on him. You remember how you were so mortified that a woman would ever do that? Remember how you promised me, you swore to me, that you would never do something like that to me? How you told me that you would always love me? I'm leaving. I would sit down if I were you. Sorry, sir. I didn't get your wine order. Would you like red or white wine? Red. Absolutely, sir. Could I get you anything else? You know what? Now that you say that... <laughs> Sit down! You told me that you loved me! And you told me that you would always love me. And then you go and cheat on me with, with this? What could he possibly give you that I haven't? He's nothing compared to me. Honey, you just, just, just put the gun down, okay? I can't explain. Oh, don't you honey me right now. You cheated on me. Because you're crazy. You treated me horribly. You were cruel. You hurt people. Look what you've done. You deserve to be cheated on. I'm glad I did it. He may have been a waiter, but he was twice the man as you ever were. Even though I hate you, I can't find it in my heart to put a bullet in your head. But I'm sure he can. Oh, honey, you didn't think you were the only one who carried a gun on them, did you? <laughs>